what is the restauranter's mindset how do successful restaurant owners think welcome to this channel and welcome to this video this is gopal kamat i am a restauranter and a Hi and welcome to Restaurant Launch Formula. My name is Gopal Kamath, and today I am going to share with you some cool strategies about how to think like a restaurant. What is the restauranter's mindset? How do successful restaurant owners think? Welcome to this channel and welcome to this video. This is Gopal Kamath. I am a restauranter and a hotelier and the founder of Restaurant Launch Formula. where we share loads and loads of successful strategies which i am doing in my business which i am seeing all my uh, colleagues doing in all the industries so lot of new strategies which you can use in order to get into this business in order to understand this business and at one point of time open your own successful business so let's get to the topic of the day today we are going to talk all about the restauranter's mindset please remember that everything starts from mindset it is all about 80% mindset and 20% strategies i can give you loads and loads of strategies you can get strategies from anywhere but unless and until you don't have the right mindset it is of no use even if god comes down and gives you a full proof successful uh, uh, road map but you don't have this belief in yourself how whether you are able to do or no you will not be able to execute that road map so the number one point which i want to focus i want to i want you to focus is about the power of belief what i mean by the power of belief is there is a there is a sense of assurity when we believe in ourselves when we think that we are able to do it we, we have the capacity to strive and that only comes when you are focusing on the information about a specific topic let's say for example restaurant so that comes that takes you to the second point that is getting a mentor unless and until you don't immerse yourself in that subject Uh, like for example you come to get your restaurant and uh, learn about the restaurants unless and until you don't immerse in that subject you don't get into it you don't as they say don't just dip a pinky toe in the water just take a dive in the water the reason is unless and until you don't immerse into this you will not be able to know the rules of the games and unless and until you don't know the rules of the games you will not be able to play the games better so that is one of the reasons why there is a lot of fear of failure that is our third point why do we have fear of failure the reason we have fear of failure is because we don't know Uh, enough information about that specific business enough information about the food business that's why we are little dicey the the lack of knowledge creates lack of experience the lack of experience creates no confidence and since you don't have any confidence you do are not in a position to take action you know you stop and you are just taken aback and you just keep on going procrastinating later because you don't have the knowledge so that is one of the reasons why i created the restaurant launch formula so that i can help you with loads and loads of information and with loads and loads of right usable practical tips and strategies and not like the other people and i just will tell you ye aisa hota hai wo aisa hota hai i'll tell you what exactly crisp strategies which you used to do which you should do in order to uh run a profitable restaurant business now the fourth point is daily routines very important the, i i would like to ask you a question imagine that you, uh, uh, every day you get up in the morning and the first thing which you do what do you do the first thing the first thing you do is to reach out to your phone to check out your messages to check the facebook likes to type uh, type yes in the chat box if you do that every day to you check your facebook every day you check your whatsapp every day you check your emails every day right i've seen lot of people that doing it right from their bed so that is the total it's a totally wrong way to start your day first of all you have to switch off your phone if uh, apart from the people who have emergencies or medical uh, somebody in uh, hospital or something you have to switch off your phone the first time the first thing which you do in the morning is you get up 
you get up, you brush your teeth, you freshen up, you have your tea, coffee, whatever. And then you go out for a walk and start warming your body. Go out for a jog, go out for whatever you like, cycling, gym, whatever. And that is about warming your body. That is about getting your body in action. And the second thing is getting your mind in action. You, do you know, do you want to know a secret what I do in order to prime my mind? Type yes in the, uh, in the description below if you love this. I listened to an audio called The Strangest Secret in the World. This is one of the, uh, it is by Earl Nightingale. I will put a, uh, I will uh, put a link in the description section. Go watch that, go listen to that audio or listen to anything inspirational. Unless and until you don't have the daily routines, you will not have the power of belief. And unless and until you will not have the power of belief, you will not get a mentor. And unless and until you will not get a mentor, you will not be able to kill the fear of failure. So these four things are totally interconnected. These four things are totally interconnected. And these four things will help you to get the right mindset, which will put you on a path towards opening a successful restaurant. I hope you guys loved the video. And I'm sure this video and the information is going to help you to open a successful restaurant of your own. Now, if you want to go more deeper and have an in-depth understanding about the restaurant business, I suggest you join my 5 days WhatsApp class. The link is in the description section under this video. And in this 5 days WhatsApp class, I take you step by step to the foundational pillars of restaurant business and the food business. What should be your concept? What should be your location? What should be your thinking like a restaurant, restauranters, uh, like our restaurant owner thinks and how should you match it with the right type of target clientele. This, these are the core pillars on which the foundation of your successful restaurant holds. So if you really want to take it to a deeper level and have a better understanding about the restaurant business, go to the link in the description section and sign up for my 5-day WhatsApp class. There is a small fee which I charge so that you guys are serious and you can take it and implement it to open a successful restaurant of your own. So see you in the 5 days WhatsApp class. Thank you so much for seeing the video up till now and see you in my next video. Thank you so much. This is Gopal Kamal signing off. Bye-bye. Love from me.